are. Now, you'll hear different preachers, and it's all semantics as far as I'm concerned. You'll hear preachers saying that we need to infiltrate culture, and we need to do this, and we need to do that. Well, I just think we need to be different. I just think we need to stand out and stand up. I think people need to see that we are different. Now, it may be unpopular with some, but for those that are being saved, it's not foolishness. Isn't that what Paul says? It's not foolishness. And for people to identify that we're different, if we just sit down like this with everyone else and relax and just maybe tweak a wee bit of culture here and a wee bit there, how are they going to find us? How are they going to find the hope? Are we, Paul talks about in 1 Corinthians or maybe it's 2 Corinthians, that we are ambassadors, that we are his representatives, Christ's representatives on this earth. But if we're sitting down here with the crowd and just milling about and not doing much, how are they going to identify us? We need to stand up. We need to stand up and show. We need to go to the, the sick person who's, who's unwell, pray for them and not be afraid to say, in Jesus' name, be healed. We need to go to the down and out. We need to go into the highways and the byways, as Jesus put it in one of his parables, and find the people that God wants to save. Reach out to them. But if we're milling about in the culture and trying to absorb the culture that's going on, what good are we? What did Jesus say? If salt has lost its flavor, what use is to it? Throw it in the bin. 